Continuing along with an update. I'm still working on that same FB. Well, zoom out here a little bit, give you an idea of the progress. I have had a few people ask me, how are you making out? Is it going to happen? Is it on the road? Well, no, it's not on the road. But we'll just do a little walk around here. Some of the parts, the small parts, have been powder coated with Eastwood's powder coating kit. Uh, works out really well. The small lines as well. I even took this all apart here on the um, the brake proportioning valve, powder coated that as well. Uh, wire harness, retaped it and uh, took parts out as they went. One of the most trying things was is when I went to put back in these motors for the um, power uh, uh, operators for the uh, headlight pods. Uh, they were just so rusted. I managed to get these new from Mazda, the uh, the drive linkages, each one over here, and the same thing back down in this corner here. So kind of makes it look uh, a little bit more like a, a new install. Um, we've been, uh, my son Scott has been uh, color sanding, so as we progress with that, we get a little bit of the, uh, the wash on here. The carpets were power washed, reinstalled, and the dash was painted, and uh, it came out very well. All the plastic parts, uh, we managed to uh, get some custom paint made for it, and we've been painting the parts uh, as it goes. New radio is installed. I'm going to have to cut the benzel around it a little bit so it fits. Unfortunately, it didn't fit into the stack the way the old one did. Uh, we had a, a CD player in there, but unfortunately, it's, we're going to have to do some trimming. And just in the back, those are the parts as well, uh, painted and just working on it. I'll lift the car up and give you a quick look underneath at where we're at. Here we are under the car. Gas tank is installed. Um, the rubber boot and all that's been all cleaned up and, and put back in. I don't know if we can see it in there or not. Oh, there we go. Uh, cleaned it all up. Uh, new lines. I have a pre-filter on this on this car for that reason. Uh, even though we did it, uh, I did a, a um, refurbish and seal with the East Tank uh, Eastwood gas tank kit. Really good. I've got to do a little bit of work here on this electrical. I've got new plugs in that. Uh, the fuel tank sender is new, so that's not going to be an issue. And basically, that's that's where we're at. Uh, bolts and stuff were were powder coated. I did them up in here as well, um, as they're coming off. The tow bar bracket, same thing there as well. It's been uh, it's been powder coated. Little by little, getting there. Um, I still figure it will be spring before we're going on the car. Uh, a little look up inside from the bottom. The battery tray was powder coated as well, and there we go. So a little bit of an update. Um, it takes what it takes, and and I, <laughs> it's it's just one of those kind of jobs.